Hey loves, welcome and welcome back to my channel. It's your favorite love vision friend Kay back with another video. Now, this video is going to be interesting because I'm about to be messy. So sit down, grab your tea, and let's get to sipping. Period. <music> basically expose the brands that's been you know inboxing me and I'm gonna link all their information in the description box but it's brand similar okay keep that in mind it's brand similar to the brands that I've been talking about so just look keep on the lookout for that but I'm exposing some Instagram brands basically so I'm just going to start it off before I started my YouTube channel. I've been getting a lot of different, you know, companies over the summer hit me up telling me to collect. They want to collab and all this other stuff because I have a very big following on Instagram. Okay. So with that being said, um, I would say I did not look up some of these brands and I kind of fell for the bait, but <laughs> not again i basically i'm your guinea pig and i did the bs for you so you wouldn't have to do it so i'm trying to help you out sis okay so when any brand dms you on instagram or even like their quote-unquote workers i feel like they're bots that are doing this will dm you be like hey these people want to collab with you send them a dm like that crap now, I would say the biggest thing you need to look for is when you do look at these brands, look at their followers, okay, the amount of followers they have, and also look at the amount of posts they make, okay? And then scroll down to their very first post and look at that date. It doesn't add up because some of these brands started this year a couple months ago a couple weeks ago and they got tons of tons of followers that's fake sweetheart it's you can buy Instagram accounts that has a very large um, followers okay and you can also tell their followers don't match the amount of likes that they have okay if a brand has let's say a hundred K followers or a million followers something like that and they only have like one two thousand likes nothing more than that if you go to a regular brand like Fashion Nova or go to like an influ influencer you know page like Diera uh, Latoya Forever Kim Kimberly Sherelle like if you look at theirs and their um you know either instagram followers are similar around the same ballpark they have a lot of more like likes on and comments on their posts okay than some of these brands that's trying to hit you up so don't forget to pay attention to that and also look on not instagram but face not look on youtube Either sometimes on Instagram and Facebook, some people do, you know, expose those brands. But look, type in some of these brand company names on YouTube and there are some, you know, what channels that basically exposes some of these brands. Now, I think about three, no, four brands did send me my products but it was very 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 low quality it was not worth 
the amount that I paid for. Now they would say that they give you a percentage. It ain't nothing. If a brand is trying to work with you, they're not going to make you pay for, you know, what they're sending you. Okay. And also if you want, you're basically, it's a win-win for some of these brands. They're ba you're paying for the product that they want you to promote and then they promote you on their page so it's like a win-win you're paying for your own promotion for them basically and it's that is not fair okay now i'm gonna link down below in the description box and i'm not gonna do it in the video i'm just link in the des description box of the brands that you need to look out for but it's a lot of them that are basically trying to use you and then they prey on smaller you know accounts that don't have that many followings or whatever so just stop wasting your money on these brands they're not really you're basically losing at the end of the day and some of them items you can look for like some of those jewelry brands that want to talk to you you can look at those items on wish for way 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 cheaper okay stop spending your money stop wasting your time because they're just gonna they're basically just using you and using clout basically so with that being said i hope that helps some of you out there i will link in the description box of what brands reached out to me and what to look out for and stuff like that now i would say i'm gonna i'm gonna basically tell you one brand is called urban ice their prices on there are way way expensive for their jewelry and they hit me up saying oh you can get a 50 percent off discount i was not here for it because their items are like 200 500 dollars i think the cheapest i seen was like 50 bucks i think but it's not worth it it really isn't and majority of the jewelry that was on their website you could find it on wish for freaking 90 percent of the price basically way way cheap so stop just stop you wasting your money wasting your time wasting your energy just stop because they're just using you okay don't forget to like comment and subscribe thank you for watching this video and i'll see you in my next one bye loves